Hey guys, today my friend Kabir, who is Indian, is going to try Dutch candy. Most of you guys know that I live in the Netherlands, even though I travel a lot. And I brought you some candy, so Thank you. let's see if you like it. I hope so. <laughs> what would you like to start out with? Uh, the best one. The best one, I think it's gonna be this one. This is Stroopwafels. It's very famous, like literally every tourist brings it back home as a souvenir. And it's really good. I only brought sweet stuff, unfortunately. Yeah, I'm fine with it. So it's like a waffle with uh, caramel in between. Sounds Just bite sweet. it. Just bite it. <laughs> Take a bigger bite. What is this? <laughs> what? It's taking only small parts. Can we cook it? This is nice. I know, I right? Like it's like good. It. What kind of rate would you give it? Between one and ten. Give seven and a half. Seven and a half? Wow. Five five. Okay. I like this. Yeah? And this would be a perfect uh, thing to eat in the morning. In the morning? It's so sweet. Yeah, that's in the daytime you can eat sweet things. In the night if you eat too much sweet, it adds mm. to your cholesterol and fat. <laughs> okay. And if you say so. Okay, I'm gonna let you try a strange cookie, which is really, really typically Dutch. So this is called bokepootjes. And it's boca oh? boca <laughs> Bokkepootjes. Bokkepootjes. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like a kind of a merengue cookie. Oh, it's really. With cream and chocolate on top. Coated and chocolate. Is it a kind of eclair? No. Try it. It's more crispy. An eclair is like, it's more soft. This is really good. I love this. But it's very typically Dutch. Mm. This is good. I like the wafer, mm. wafer kind of chocolate. It's good, right? Mm. And wafer and on top of uh, mm -hmm. there's chocolate and all like that. Yeah. What kind of grade would you give it? It's an upgrade over Kit Kat. So I would give it 8.5. I do agree with that. It is an upgrade of Kit Kat. Kit Kat, yeah. Book of pouches, awesome. What is it called? Book of pouches. How do you spell it? Book? No, it's a long word. The, it, it's um, literally translated, book a, a book is a male goat. So it's like male goat paws because it looks like a little bit like. So it's part of a male goat's body or something else. It's named after it. Something else. No, no, you perv, stop it. Not a. <laughs> it looks like that. So. <clears throat> okay, so this is super traditional during the Dutch holiday Sinterklaas. Sinterklaas is Sint Nicholas Saint, who comes. Saint, Santa Claus. No, 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 it's different than Santa Claus. So St. Nicholas, it's, it's in the same... But St. Nicholas was from Greece. Well, okay, let me just tell you the Dutch story. <laughs> Before you start getting all intellectual on me. The story is St. Nicholas every year comes to the Netherlands from Spain with his... Um, well, not servants, but his helpers. And they... Um, his entourage. His entourage, yes. Yeah. He's a VIP. And then he gives all the children gifts and um, it's kind of like Santa Claus but the Dutch version. Santa and if Claus you're without being very commercial. Yes. Yeah. Well no, because it's <laughs> still a very commercial holiday. And or was that sarcastic? That was sarcastic. Ah okay. Okay. No, yes, yeah, exactly. Then but um so but there is a twist. Like if you're a bad kid, Santa Claus takes you in his bag to back to Spain and then I don't know what, what then happens. How you get to eat candy all year long or how something. Would, how would that be bad? Like, go I know, right? From going from the cold temperatures of Holland to go to Spain. How is that bad? My point for Super many, sushi. many years. I, I always tried going back with the city class. Yeah. So be, okay. a, so, be a bad kid and go to Spain. Yes, that's the message. <laughs> so, so these are like small biscuits. It's called Kruidnoten. Kruidnoten, come on, come on. Kryptonite. Kruidnoten. Kruid? Kruidnoten. 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 Yes, very good. Nice. Are they so good? <laughs> this is so good. Five out of ten. Five out of ten? You don't like this? Yeah, no. Really? Not much. Mm, why? Like this. Hmm? Very bland. Okay. You're so Indian. It needs spices. It needs cardamom. No, it needs to. Like for me, if I'm having a candy, it has to be have some kind of. Uh, okay, wait, wait. I have. I also have the chocolate coated version. So do you like white chocolate, milk chocolate, or 
Dark chocolate. Free chocolate. What does that mean? Free. <laughs> free? You don't yeah. care? Any I take care. Okay, I will give you milk. What's the white one? White chocolate. I like white chocolate. You like white chocolate? You can try the white chocolate after this. Hard. <laughs> <laughs> no? It's not your thing? No, I think that's I think You, you want to try the white one? Because it's too hard. That's what she said. <laughs> mm, what? No. I'm good with this. Yeah? No? Again, a five or even lower? Five. Five? Oh man. Wow. Let me give you something extremely sweet. So this looks like shit because it has been in a suitcase and it's messed up. But it's like. um. Okay. It's called Rose Kuka. Like Rose Kuka. Rose Kuka. Literally translated, it means like pink, pink cake. Uh, a Kuka from Russia? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. This does not look good. This looks like shark fins. Okay, wait. Baked. No, no. It's, okay, try it a little. It's, <laughs> it's very sweet. Some people can't eat it because it's too sweet. So it's like cake with pink icing on top, but the pink icing is very sweet. Very good. You like it? I like this one. Yeah? <laughs> what kind of grade would you give it? Uh, B. B? What kind of grade do you give it? Between 1 and 10. Okay, that's pretty. Okay, who cares? He's, he's so intellectual. <laughs> uh, I would give it 8. 8? Okay. What, what was the name? Russo Cooker. Russo Cooker. Russo Cooker. Russo Cooker. Yeah. Wow. I yeah. love the name. <laughs> okay. This one. Un bad cook. Un bad cook. Yes. <laughs> one bad cook? No. No. Un bad cook literally means breakfast cake. Breakfast cake. Yeah. So you usually would eat it with uh, for breakfast, breakfast or, or in between. In India, we say breakfast. Then you say breakfast. Breakfast, yeah. Exactly. But um, you would, uh, they usually put butter on top. Uh. <laughs> and uh, you eat it either as a snack in between or um, for breakfast. So, kind of. Hmm? So you add, you put a layer of butter, butter on, on top it, of it. Top yeah. Of it, and then you don't toast? No good? No. Yes. Although that sounds good. I never tried that. Hmm. Good idea. We have the. Sandwiches which have mm -hmm. a layer of chocolate in it. Mm -hmm. They grill it and then it becomes chocolate grilled sandwich. Yes. It this, this sounds is not amazing, but when I saw it, I was like, no, no, no. No, wasn't that good? Mm. Okay. I, I, I didn't try it. But tried. A lot of people tried. So it. So, one bad cook. On, on the bad cook. On bad cook. The one we can. Mm -hmm. Breakfast food. With breakfast. Uh, breakfast. With, with butter. Mm -hmm. Fast. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Take it. Stop procrastinating. You guys think it's bland too. What does that like? Hmm? You do? Really? What is something I would call it as an easy food? It is. It is. Yeah. Maybe when you're sick. <laughs> when, uh, something. So when I wake up, I'm more I'm mentally I'm sick when I wake up. Mm, oh. Yeah, he's, he's really bad at waking up in the morning. Mm. That's why we're always so late. Like you have to literally wait for him for hours to wake up. <laughs> Otherwise, you don't want to wake them up. About, sure. that, about that food was yeah. uh, what I like for me. Yeah. For my own experience is when in the morning I want to eat something, it shouldn't be too crispy. Mm. It okay. should be soft. It should. Not oh, be too so hard. you're team soft. <sighs> what does that mean? There's team crispy and team soft. So usually in America you have like the che team, the chewy cookies and you have the crispy cookies, and I love crispy things and crispy food. So you have team crispy and team chewy or team soft. So that's but apparently you're team chewy. Part of the first one. Yeah. That's right. Mm-hmm. Press well problems. <laughs> okay, what kind of grade would you give it? In India we have either you go for butter or you go for cheese. What? Yeah. In food. Butter or cheese? Butter or cheese. Why? Let's say you went for palm bhaji. Yeah. Yeah. But Yesterday. Personally, I love cheese from Yeah. Love it. Like, yeah. I wouldn't eat without cheese. Okay. Because there are other, there are other people 
Who want would the butter? Never, who would not want ah, the butter? Okay. Who don't want the cheese? Okay. Uh, palm bhaji is brilliant. If you ever come to Mumbai, try palm bhaji. Okay. Not from Juhu. Mumbai is famous for it. Not from Juhu. Not from Juhu. <laughs> okay. What kind of grade would you give this one? Uh, I'd give 7.5. 7.5. For being Quite really high. nice, uh, easy food to eat and okay. irrespective of whether you like sweet or not, I think this will yeah, be... Yeah, it's very mellow. Yeah, it, it's not a... It dwells well with yeah. the... Okay, like, so the next one. This looks heavy. This He's a lawyer, heavy. he talks too much. No getting big, so. <laughs> <laughs> so this is called Merkpijpjes. Mm. And um, it's cake with cream and coated in marzipan and coated in chocolate. Mm. We like coating things in the Netherlands. Yeah, I really organized, yeah. Yeah, it is, right? Mm. This is good. Yeah? All right. You think so? Can you say Merkpijpjes? Let me read it. No, 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 it's because you will pronounce it wrong. The, the G is like. <laughs> Merkpijpjes. Merkpijpjes. No, niet Merk. Merkpijpjes. Merkpijpjes. Merk. Merkpijpjes. Merk. Merk okay. <laughs> this is good sweet. Good? Yeah. You like it? What kind of grade? 7.5. 7.5. Wow. Okay. Now, we're going in for the real strong stuff. This is drop. It's licorice. Drona. Drop. 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 You said drop. 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 No. Drop. <laughs> no. It's licorice and the Netherlands is quite famous for it. We have many, many different varieties. I brought you the, the most mild one because you also have a salty version and I don't I can't even eat the salty version because it's like You should smell it, smell it. Then take a coin. It, this is this is mint drop you, because you have many different varieties, but this is like a little bit sweet, a little bit more on the firm side. <laughs> Whoa, well, the mint. <laughs> have you smelled it? No? That's not your jam? Definitely not. Oh my gosh. Okay, what kind of grape? Not qualified. Not qualified? Not Nothing. Good. Zero. It's Minus. Not, it's not food for me. Okay. It's not crispy, it's not soft, it's uh, some animals it's droppings have been <laughs> for years and then and it's so <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Cool. Well, thank you so much for being a good sport. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, put a thumbs up. And if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, click that subscribe button. And bye, Grumpy Cat. Bye, Shrek. <laughs> what button is that? Drop? Drop. 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 Mint drop. Mint drop. Okay, uh, whenever I go to Europe, especially if I go to Holland, I'll stay away from that. I will let you try the salty version, which is even more horrible. This was good version? This is the good version, yeah. Salty version is even worse. Best one was... Which one did you like most? Oh. Uh, you really like this one? I uh, like Boca that... Uh, Rosso... Rosso Cuco? Rosso Cuco. <laughs> and uh, One Bad Cook. One Bad Cook? One Bite Cook. Yeah. And uh, that... Uh, Merk Pijpjes. Merk Pijpjes. Okay. Yeah, that's, uh, cool. That's more... And Rosso Cook is your favorite? The, the Rosso Cook is my favorite. No, cool. I, I would go for like Rosso Cook and this one. And on Bad Cook? On wow. Cook. Yeah, both. Okay, cool. It's like one is like very really bland and easy to eat. The other one is like sweet and soft. So it's perfect for breakfast. <laughs> uh, this one, the Eclair one, the higher... Book post. Book post first. Yeah. Impressive. Really cool. impressive. So I like Dutch sweets. Okay. Besides that, uh, drop. Punishment. <laughs> of trying that mint drop. Okay. Drop. Well, thank you so much for trying this. You're welcome. And thank you for introducing me to the. Uh, You're welcome. Most of the good things. You've introduced me to so much in new food, so it's yeah. the least that I could do. Pao Maji? What a No, I didn't have Pao Maji with you. Dosa. Dosa I had with Pizza, you. Pizza, Starbucks. Also. <laughs> Alright, so train you. Please. Pizza and Starbucks. Okay, whatever. We're ending this video. Bye!